connective tissue uh, that is known as septa. Clear visibility of vessels in lungs is because of difference in density as uh, the vessels uh, have blood, the blood looks white and the lung tissue, lung parenchyma has air which appears black on x-ray. So the vessels that are white are passing through something which appears black and, and this contrast of black and white shadows makes the vessels clearly stand out and clearly visible on a chest x-ray. The loss of definition of small vessels in lungs in case of pulmonary edema is simply because there is a the fluid around vessels and then lung tissue gets filled with uh, fluid losing air and hence losing that contrast of black and white. Bigger vessels in hyla in this case are not visible because of one more reason. All the lymphatics diverge towards hyla and these uh, have fluid uh, within them which makes the visibility of vessels difficult. In acute changes such as myocardial infarction or heart attack, in simple language, lymphatics within interstitium do not have enough time to drain excess fluid and air spaces are quickly filled, decreasing oxygen levels in blood which can often cause death. Often but not always in case of acute pulmonary edema, you will see normal heart size. One more thing to remember is that pulmonary edema can be cardiogenic or non-cardiogenic in nature. And the last thing to remember from today's lesson that other conditions can create exactly similar image. So history, blood test, echocardiography and other tests together make a diagnosis. The radiologist will often report such an x-ray as bilateral diffuse consolidation rather than trying to do the job of a treating physician. The other things uh, that are visible on this chest x-ray ECG wires, ECG button here and here this gas is in the stomach and there is a key either in patient's pocket or hanging around the neck and the other thing that is clearly visible on this x-ray is the, the the volume of lung is not normal the lungs look larger the shape of the 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 only hemidiaphragm that is clearly visible the right hemidiaphragm is not dome shape so lungs have or are losing the elasticity they are bigger in volume and the uh, dome uh, the diaphragm has lost its normal dome shape they are more towards the the more like like flat uh, shape diaphragms and this is uh, probably because of uh, chronic obstructive pulm pulmonary disease COPD and often you'll find the patients uh, that have COPD uh, are usually smokers so this patient might have been a smoker that would increase the chances of uh, sudden myocardial infarction and will uh, explain the acute pulmonary edema. I would like to, this x-ray was copied from www.redpot.org and I would like to show you a normal chest x-ray. So you can compare, this is a, a normal chest x-ray uh, courtesy of Dr. Alex McLennan from UK. The vessels are clearly visible, dome shaped diaphragms and there are no curly B lines. You can even see the smaller vessels going through the lung parenchyma. 
Thank you very much.